guys welcome back to my channel sorry if you can hear loads of wind all of the um doors and windows are open because it's so hot it's literally been like 22 degrees today i'm also resembling a boiled egg it's currently friday evening now i finished work about two hours ago an hour ago um but i've just got ready in my gym stuff i think i'm gonna do a weekend vlog i've not really got many plans this weekend i just feel like i need to sort my shit out like i was in manchester last weekend and that just effed my sleeping pattern up and my room's just been a mess my head's been a mess my life's been a mess so i need to sort my stuff out i've also got busy weekends like next weekend i'm going to the races and then after that i think i'm going out with my friend and the weekend after that yeah there's just a lot going on for the next foreseeable future i feel like i'm just gonna take this weekend just to reset myself i'm gonna try get back into a bit of a routine with the gym because i've only gone once this week so far but i quite like going on weekends like i feel like i actually have time and i'm not rushing because when i go after work i'm always like oh my god i need to just get in get out get home and then by the time i've had my tea like got showered got my stuff ready for work like then it's literally time to watch love island also i'm so excited to watch love island tonight so last night was the recoupling and oh my god so much drama i love it i don't really have much plans for tonight i'm seeing my boyfriend like i said we're going to the gym we need to take our dogs for a walk um and then maybe get some snacks maybe have some tea before love island um but yeah that's my plans for this evening tomorrow i feel like i need to have a sort out day and also a sunbathing day because the weather is so nice i've literally been obsessed with that got to be glue um gel for my eyebrows it literally makes them look laminated i love it um also i got my biab nails redone yesterday can you see them um i've just got french tip i always go back to french and like oh like like last time i had like orange french tip for my holiday but like after uh, like every set i go back to french tip i don't know why i just don't get it all the time um but i also need to book in a pedicure I don't know if I'm going to do it this weekend or next week, but I need to book that in anyway. I need to sort my wardrobe out and all of my drawers, like, they are such a state. I put loads of stuff on Vinted, um, so I need to sort that out. And, yeah, just have a whole life reset, to be honest. But I hope you enjoy the vlog. Let me know if you like these sort of videos because I love watching these type of videos. Like they're my favourite ones to watch. But I know you guys might not like that. And also because I do so many like vlogs, like holiday vlogs, going away vlogs, like doing this, doing that. Like that is literally not my life all the time. That is about one weekend a month. So I feel like it's just good to share a bit of real life. Like... This is what I do majority of the weekends, especially like if we're trying to save money or something. Like, this bitch cannot be affording that every weekend, even though I wish I could. Um, so yes. Oh, also, I've had an exciting day yesterday. Me and my friend booked Ibiza. Literally so excited. We've been talking about booking this for ages. So the friend that I'm going with, we've literally been besties since we were four years old and when we were younger we was always like we're gonna go on holiday together like we're gonna do this together and we actually are like it was kind of stressful booking it because i feel like trips in the uk i'm so good at planning like i'll plan everything like i love it but when it's abroad i just get a bit scared with the flights and that i think it's because i've had like bad experiences before with like trying to change holiday dates and flight dates but we finally booked it so far we've booked ocean beach and ushuaia we're seeing craig david and mk there no not craig david that's what i'm seeing next weekend i'm seeing oh who's it calvin harris calvin harris and mk i got a bit confused because i'm seeing him next weekend of the races but 
I am going to resemble this in most of the video, like probably. I've also ordered a Revlon hot styling brush. So hopefully that comes tomorrow because I want to wash my hair tomorrow and try it out. So fingers crossed that comes. It does say it's on the way. I ordered it from, I think it's called Just My Look, but it was literally on TikTok for the longest time, but I've just not brought it like i'm always so late to the trends but i like to just leave it and see how people like it first and also i feel like products that should get cancelled on tiktok every other week like like people will be absolutely loving a product and then people on tiktok like this is bad for you like this is that like how did you love it two seconds ago and i'll be there like mm, cancelled the product speaking of that i literally use my saint i've scrub all the time Sue me. Okay, I've just been sat here chatting for ages and my boyfriend just texted me and was on the way. I need to get ready. Speak to you soon. Love you. Bye. We are back from the gym. We just did some cardio on the running machine. I was doing a bit of running because we were both so hungry. We had beans on toast for tea, hour and that is a good meal. And we're just taking the dogs for a walk. Liam's just gone to get his dog. Do you know who's coming on the walk? Ozzy, <gasps> your bestie's coming on the walk. Wow. Oh my God, he's so cute. He's sitting down because he knows he's going for a walk. You're such a good boy. I'm talking. It's like half seven now, quarter to eight by the time Liam gets here because it's just been so hot, like too hot to walk them. So we're going on our walk now, aren't we? Yes. Yeah, I had one really early this morning, but if anyone has a jackapoo or anything crossed with like a poodle you know they're literally nuts my dog has so much energy bear in mind he's like running around all day as well he goes on so many walks don't you Alp? oh my god you're so cute we've also got him this like um it's like a gun and it's got tennis balls in and you can shoot <laughs> You can shoot them to the top of the garden and he's obsessed with it. He literally wears them out so much. But that's what you need to do because you always have so much energy. Getting his harness on is such a struggle. I always have to, um, I always have to give him a treat so he'll put his head through the harness. Watch, it's so funny. Sit, no sit, head through. Good boy. Good morning guys, it's the next day now, um, me and Liam didn't really do much last night, we just sat and watched. We just sat and watched Love Island, um, I'm not putting my face in the camera much because I literally look like an egg, um, but I've just woke up, it's so hot today so I'm gonna go to the gym, get it done before it starts to get really hot i mean i've been outside already and it's so warm um so i'm gonna go there i think i'm gonna do arms and abs um but yes i'll speak to you after that i am back from the gym i went to the range and got my dog a doggy paddling pool so we're gonna put that up later see if he likes it i mean i'm not sure if he will he'll probably just look at it and then not ever use it but at least it's there for him i need to seriously deep clean and declutter my room this weekend um i'm gonna start by just getting everything off my desk and putting all that away um and then i don't know if i'm gonna have time to do it this morning because i am going out in a bit um but then i'm gonna basically just sort out all my drawers sort out my bathroom i've got so many bits in there that i need to sort out and my wardrobe is literally a state i don't know why it gets so bad I just should just like put things away as I go, but I never do that. So this is going to be sorting out. Cue the time lapse. Okay, the desk is a little bit better now. It's not like fully declutter yet i just want to get everything away because i find it so hard to like clean and stuff when everything's just everywhere so i've done that first i need to make my bed now
we were gonna have a picnic, but now we fancy eat fish and chips, so I think we're gonna get that and then have a fish and chip picnic. Not really a picnic, we just sat there eating it, but that is the plans for today. Um, I'm not vibing my makeup or just this look at the minute. I really need to do my hair because I was waiting for my Revlon brush to come so I could use it, but it's not arrived before I got ready, which is annoying as fuck, but it's fine. We've secured the fish and chips. We're gonna eat them in the car because I feel like it's gonna go cold by the time we actually get there, but then we're gonna go for a walk. Wanna be in the vlog? Cute! Also, how awkward they gave me my sausage in this. <laughs> we are back home. We just went on a little walk, but I secured the goods. I've got these ice lollies and then I got some crunchy ones. Crunchy blasts. I've never seen these before, but I'm gonna try some. And we're just chilling in the garden. We've got my dog's pool up, but he's just not really liking it. He's not really interested. I think he's a bit scared of it. I'm just eating my dinner and watching some YouTube before I start the declutter on my room. I've got spaghetti bolognese and some garlic bread and watching YouTube. I'm watching Katie Musa and I literally love her videos. So I'm going to sit down and watch this. Yum. I have finished my dinner now and I'm going to start my declutter so i'm gonna start with these drawers first they've basically just got like makeup skincare random shit in there so i need to sort that all out like look at that drawer that's just a mess um these aren't i mean that is not that bad but i just need to put everything a bit more tidier so i'm gonna start decluttering these also it's just so hot in my bedroom like this is why i've been putting it off and it's still absolutely boiling and it's like half seven eight o'clock so this is not a good time to start and declutter but when the heat is this bad it's just what needs to be done i'm just gonna start by taking everything out of the drawer I wish I could keep my makeup tidy, but like I've just got so much of it. I feel like if I just had one product for each thing, it would just be so much better. But I've just got so much. Like this isn't even all my makeup. I've got makeup in this drawer as well. But this is like the stuff I use on the reg. So this is why I've got it in here. I mean, at the end of the day, I just need to get rid of this because it's way too dark for me it's never ever gonna be my shade at the end of the day it's so pretty though like i just love having it in my makeup drawer i'm really trying to be better at like just having one thing at a time or buying like one thing at a time say if i've got like a bronzer or like a face wash or something um just because otherwise i end up just like using half of them and just having loads of stuff left and one is just wasteful and two waste my money three i just like having one thing like i really love just to like i would love just to live like a minimalist life but like i've brought so much stuff over the years that i've just got loads so i am getting better like using my stuff up before i buy a new one but for someone who literally loves makeup and has loved makeup since they were like 16, this bitch has got a lot of stuff. Um, these little makeup organisers I got from B&M, by the way, they're actually so good. This is all lip stuff here. What the hell? This is not necessary. I got this blur and primer from Revolution ages ago and I really don't like it. I've seen on TikTok that this girl loved it, but... It just made my makeup go all weird. My sister said she liked it though, so she can have that if she likes. I'm just gonna use my, oh my God, them birds outside. God, they are going off tonight. Thank you for stopping. Um, oh my God, they've started again. 
I'm using my, I'm just going to talk over them now because they're not stopping anytime soon. I'm using my Zoflora. This is the one that smells like the alien perfume and it just smells so nice. I'm just going to give this a good clean out. I feel like I honestly need to like do a like mini declutter like once a month and then my stuff just wouldn't get that bad like it's not actually that bad i'm being a bit dramatic but like i just find if all my drawers are messy my room's messy like it just makes my head so much messier stresses me out so yeah i'm just one of them people i'm gonna put all of these little containers back in now and give them a good clean out all my makeup stuff gets so messy also this is in the light so it's gonna look so dirty perfect i think i'm gonna sort through all of this lip stuff now because i've literally had most of these for ages like i bought this when i went on a school trip in year nine and i'm now 21 this year so that is definitely out of date um i'm gonna go through this though because my mum loves having all my makeup so i'm gonna oh, i'm gonna sort this out and probably give most of it to her i'm gonna start putting everything back in here now I was just sorting out some of my um, old makeup and I feel like some of it I just don't want to chuck away because it's literally got like a memory attached to it. I know that sounds absolutely crazy but like some things like I brought like when I was on certain holidays or trips or like it was my first look, like one of it. But yeah I need to get rid of some because it's literally so out of date. I'm going to pop everything back in now. My camera died, but I basically just finished putting everything in this drawer. I feel like my makeup just never looks that tidy, but it's tidy for me. This is all the stuff which I'm getting rid of. Uh, when I say get rid of, I'll probably give it to my mum or my sister. I mean, these are literally disgusting. I've had them for so long now. Um, but And stuff like this as well. Like I said, I've literally had some of the stuff since I was about in year eight or nine but yeah i'm just either gonna give this away or chuck it in the bin just like some of the stuff i literally will never use like these are samples of um lipsticks but like i don't use any of these colors so i mean i'm sure my mum will use colors like that but like this eyeshadow palette i've literally had for so long and yeah i just don't use most of this stuff so i'm gonna let my mum i don't know why everything's not focusing i'm gonna let my mum see if she wants any of this stuff i then just sorted out this top drawer so this is all my like makeup palettes in the back um just on my jewelry i've got some hand sanitizers there all of my sponges um i've decided i'm gonna keep this because when i do start to fake tan that's obviously darker than my natural tan um so i'm gonna see if this will work when i've got fake tan on but i just don't want to chuck it away guys like it's so much money and i've literally used it twice so we'll see about that <sighs> I then sorted out this drawer as well. These are just all of my like moisturizers and tanning stuff. So obviously I'm not tanning at the minute because it's summer. So I've got all my tanning stuff at the back there. Um, these body moisturizers, my Sol de Janeiro body moisturizer, which is literally the best one. The Bum Bum Cream is so nice. Um, yeah, this is what I've got in this drawer. And then I've just got my mitts at the back there chucking away this from my tan and stuff because i've had this for so long and it's gone all disgusting and like i don't know it's got like all just it looks all like cloudy so i'm definitely chucking this away i'd probably turn green if i use that now i also sorted out this top drawer it's basically just got loads of my books in um, my notepads i've got some euros here from my holiday that i've just been on left over so yeah that's in this drawer disposable camera pretty boring stuff in there 
I really want to clean my hair brushes. I've literally never done that before. Like, obviously, like, I've cleaned them as in just, like, take the hair out of them. But I've seen on TikTok people are, like, actually fully putting them in, like, water and fully cleaning them. So, I'm gonna do that. I've seen this girl, she's like, you're meant to do it every month. Um, what? I've literally never done that. I didn't even know you were meant to do that. But apparently it's meant to stop your hair going greasy and just gets rid of, like, the build-up of products in the hairbrushes. So I'm going to do that now. I've just filled up the sink with some hot water. I'm going to use this Beauty Works Clarifying Shampoo and just put that in there before I put the brushes in. These are all the brushes that I'm going to try clean. So I've got some combs, some normal brushes. And then this is, like, a scalp mm, exfoliator thing. So I'm going to put these in and see what happens. I've just popped them all in there and then I'm going to leave them about half an hour and I'll come back and see what they're like. I'm a bit worried the water's going like, to go inside the actual brush so let's hope that doesn't happen. I've got these two massive bags of clothes from my last declutter. I put some of them on Vinted but they've been on there for quite a while now so I'm not sure if they're going to sell. So I'm just going to sort these out into two piles of stuff which needs to go to the charity shop and then stuff which I'm going to keep and might sell. Like some things I still need to put on there so I'm going to sort those out into two piles now. <laughs> I need to sort out my skincare drawer now. Um, I'm really trying to use up all of my like little samples and stuff. So then I just have like one moisturizer, one cleanser, um, because I just have so much at the minute. I've finished all of this now. It's the L'Oreal Hydrogenous Aloe Water, and I literally love it. That doesn't look finished, but that's just from the front. I literally can't get any more out because of the way the packaging is. But that is so nice, especially in summer. It, like, cools your face right down. I've also been loving this night cream from Comfort Zone. I really like having, like, a day moisturiser and a night moisturiser. I feel like it makes such a difference to your skin. And it, like, this one's, like, really super hydrating, whereas the day one's a bit more light. I think I'm going to get rid of this just because I've had it for absolutely years. And every time I've used it, it's made my skin break out a little bit. So I'm going to get rid of this or ask my mum if she wants it. I'm going to give this um, Paula's Choice liquid exfoliate to my sister because she absolutely loves it. But it just breaks my skin out so much. Like I have tried to use it quite a few times. And it just doesn't work for my skin. So I'm going to give that one to her. This is basically the same product. It's just from a different brand. So I'm going to give her this one as well. I've got so many moisturizers that have got like little bits in like this. So I need to use these sort of ones up as well. And this Nivea Soft Moisturizer. There's actually a tiny bit left in that. So I'm going to use these up. I'm gonna put all these face masks back in here um just because they're already all neat and tidy in this tub i've got loads of little like um pore strips charcoal um little masks teeth whitening strips i've got a little jade face roller there um i've got another jade face roller here i've got a little derma planning tool which i'm gonna pop in there too I do have my gua sha somewhere, but I have no clue where that's gone, so I'm just going to leave that there for a minute. I'm going to pop in the moisturisers, which I need to use up first um, at the front here, so I remember to use them. This face mask as well is an Elemis one. I've only got a little bit left in there, so I'm going to pop that at the front. These are the main skincare bits I'm using at the minute. These are like the mini, so I'm going to put them further to the front too this eye cream from primark's really good i really want to try the bondi sands one but i'm not going to buy that until i've used this one up as i'm trying to do 
This is a really nice affordable face cream as well. It's from the vitamin E range from Superdrug. It's got SPF 15 in there as well. I've then just got some facial oils here. Just pop them here. I don't really use facial oils that often, but I use them when I use my like gua sha and my face rollers. This is a um, facial exfoliator. This will be really good to take away because it's so small. I'm going to pop that one at the back as well because I've got um, exfoliators which I'm already using in my bathroom. I've got another body exfoliator. This is really good to take on holiday. Just pop my Lush lip scrubs back there. I am going to get rid of this toner just because I have used it before and it breaks my skin out quite a bit. I think any like really harsh toners like... I should just steer clear from because that Paula's Choice one doesn't work on my skin either. And I have had this for quite a while too. So, and I've used about half of it. So it's not like I didn't give it a try. But yeah, I think I'm going to have to get rid of that one. I've then just got some more mini um, moisturisers and face masks. I'm just going to pop them in here. I'm going to pop these ones at the back and then I'll bring them forward once I've used up this stuff. I've then got my rapid lash and a little brush to put on face masks with. Um, and then my Mario Badescu, um facial spray. I literally barely ever use this. I use it mainly um, when I like wet my products for my eyebrows. But I might try to start using this again. There's only a tiny bit left so I should use that really. I think that's everything. I've got a little hair mask here, but I'm going to put that in my bathroom um, so I can use that too. But the skincare drawer is looking a lot better. There's nowhere near as much as I used to have in there, which is good. I have been really trying to use up like all my stuff. And also, it's helped me get in a bit of a better skincare routine because I've got all these different like serums and moisturisers. The next thing I'm going to move on to is my hair drawer. So I've got two hair drawers. This is more like um, my hair tools. But I've got loads of other random stuff in here too, like hair oils. That one, I've made it leak so bad, I don't even know how I need to clean that up. I think I am going to give this curling wand away. Um, it's a Remington one, but I just don't really use a barrel, which is this thin anymore. Um, and I've got my Beauty Works curler, and I've also got another curler too. So I don't think I need this one. I literally find these pink spoolies everywhere. I've got just loads in here. I just find them literally everywhere. I don't even know why. Got some aloe vera gel here, so I'm gonna pop this in my skincare drawer because I've got quite a bit of room at the back there and I do use that on my face quite a bit. just put my heat protectant mat at the back there and then I'm just rolling up all of my um, hair styling tools and popping them in the drawer. These are all my hair tools in there so I've just got my hair dryer, my waver, my two curlers and my straighteners there. I've got some spare heat protectants which I'm going to pop at the back here. I'm going to put my Beauty Works oil in this drawer as well because I can stand it up here and it does leak quite a bit. This oil is so good though, like it smells unreal and makes your hair feel so nice. And I love the packaging. I mean, I know I said mine leaked, but I think it's because I had it let down. But like the packaging's like so nice and just like clean and it's got a little like a dropper thing. I just love it. I'm gonna pop that at the back there along with my two heat protectants. This is the next drawer, so this is all of my hair products, my hair brushes, my scrunchies. I'm going to start by putting all my scrunchies in this makeup bag just so they're all in one place because this is why this drawer gets oh, gets so messy. Okay, I've cleaned this drawer out. I mean, not that it looks like it because it still looks so dirty, but it is what it is. Um, I've just put my bobby pins and some of my hair bands in there. I'm going to put them at the back so I don't really use them that much. 
but for all of my like um sectioning clips my little claw clips these ones i've just put them in this little um drawstring bag because i feel like that's why this drawer gets so messy because like clips and that like, just go absolutely everywhere um and then i've put all of my scrunchies in this makeup bag and then all of my rollers here i'm gonna pop this at the back because i don't really use them that often this might be a bit of an issue Okay, I think I'm going to have to try put these rollers in here um, with my other stuff because they do not fit in this massive bag. Just going to pop the rest at the back where you can't see them. Right, okay, that's fine. Then I'm going to put all of my hair products in this bit down here. Again, with my hair products, I'm trying to use them up. I think I have used quite a bit up. But, yeah, I've just got loads of oils. Like, that's my thing. I absolutely love buying oils. I'll pop this dry shampoo down here because it doesn't fit in this bit. And my got to be glued stuff. I actually use that for my eyebrows, but I'm still going to put that in my hair drawer. I've got some more little elastic bands in that thing down there. I think that is it though. I'm going to put my hair brushes in this one because this one is really not that full. Um, obviously, my hair brushes are still in the sink. I'm not taking them out yet. So I'm just going to pop my combs there. And then I've got like a few hair bands um, that I'm just going to pop at the back because I don't really use them that often. Perfect. Those two drawers are done now. I've just taken my hair brushes out and I've put them on a towel to dry. Um, I think that's all I'm going to do for tonight because it's literally like 10 o'clock now. Um, and I have got editing to do for tomorrow night's upload. Um, also, let me know if you guys are liking the two uploads a week or not. I upload every Sunday and Wednesday. Um, yeah, let me know if you're liking it. Is it too many videos? Would you rather just one long video a week? Um, yeah, let me know what you feel about that because I can obviously do whatever you guys would want to see. I think I'm just going to take my makeup off now, get into bed and start editing my video and then I will catch up with you guys in the morning. Good morning everyone, happy Sunday. Um, I've just been out on a walk with my friend this morning which was really nice to catch up with her um, and Liam's about to pick me up and we're gonna go get stuff for a picnic. We was meant to do it yesterday but we thought oh no let's get fish and chips and then we regretted it after so we're doing that today, having a wholesome Sunday. Um, I am gonna try my best to sort out my wardrobe later but I've also got my video to edit, so we'll see what it goes like with the time. But it's just such nice weather outside today. When I was walking earlier, I was literally boiling, but it was so, so nice. And yeah, that is the plan for today. I'm gonna try find a picnic blanket. I don't even know if we have one, so I might need to buy one. But that's what I'm doing. There's little ducks in the water. There's usually ducklings here, but they're not any here at the minute. Go keep them up. I'm a bit scared to put my camera over this wall. Look! Oh, there's big ones there. So peaceful. Liam with the picnic. With the picnic snack secured. We are sat eating our food. So pretty. It's like a massive cliff here, and people are, um, what do you call it? Rock climbing. Mm. Rock climbing off these bits here. They're so tall. So beautiful. We're home now from our picnic. I was having a dance party to my meal. But 
We're just sat at home now because it's so hot and Liam said I've burnt my scalp. I don't know if I have, but he said I've burnt my scalp. And I was burning when I was out, so we came home. Um, that pool I got for my dog, he does not like it at all. I've even put like ice cubes in there, I put all of his toys, I put it in the shade, but he's really not bothered by it. My, just my look party came. So, I'm very excited. I got my, oh my god, the seagulls are back, guys. I got my Revlon hot styling brush. I'm going to film a get ready with me on Saturday. So, I'm going to use this then and see how it goes. Oh, see how it goes. But I'm really excited to try that. And then I got some, like, drying lotion from Bye Bye Blemish. I think it's meant to be similar to the Mario Badescu drying lotion. So, I got that to try because I don't have a spot cream anymore. I look like I've been trapped for a bush the makeup's patchy the hair is not a vibe but it's what's the time it's seven minutes to love island time but uh, i've not really been doing much to be honest i guys i know i said i'd do my wardrobe today but i just can't be bothered i've just uploaded my manchester vlog and i edited a tiktok to post for that um but yeah i really just cba now um, I'm so excited for Love Island tonight. Hopefully it's beefy. The weekend is almost over. What the heck? It's literally Sunday evening already. How do the weekends go so quick? But I've literally had such a nice weekend. I just love having weekends, like just organising my stuff, resetting my life. I've been on loads of walks today. Um, I went on a, another walk with my dog earlier and yeah that was a really nice too um so i've definitely got the steps in today i feel like next week is gonna be a bit of a crazy week and potentially weekend after or the weekend after that but i've got plans coming out of my ears like yeah i feel like i definitely needed this weekend also i'm still not feeling like a hundred percent i don't know what it is like i keep like not being able to like sleep through the night that well and just waking up feeling really ill in the mornings so i don't know what's going on with me i need a health shot or something but do you know what i always are really intrigued about when people get them vitamin injections is that what it's called a b12 shot i'm not sure but you know when people get like um vitamins and nutrients injected into them that is what i feel like i need i feel like i definitely need that but at the same time i'm scared like what am i injecting into me like that scares me but this is gonna be me for the rest of the evening now just gonna chill out and watch love island i'm gonna try and have a productive week with reset for it so this is me for the evening i'm also debating to start filming like weekly vlogs so potentially one of my videos a week would be a weekly vlog so let me know your thoughts on that even message me on instagram let me know in the comments below yeah just let me know what you guys like to see <laughs> 